Colombian native and former United States Army paratrooper Javier Molinares knew well the struggle of learning a new language. So with the help of Blanca Garcia, Molinari started the Brevard Hispanic Center in 2013 to help adults get a better grasp of English. We raise their level of skills in English so they can get a good job, says Molinaris. In six years, the local nonprofit that Molinaris launched has grown well beyond teaching a new language. Retired physician Dr. Freddy de la Cruz volunteered to man a weekly clinic that provides medical help for any individual without health insurance, Hispanic or not. Many of these people would go to the emergency room to get assistance, explains Molinaris. Now they can come here. We're helping to keep people without real medical emergencies from burdening the emergency rooms. Because legal concerns can be particularly challenging for low-income families or individuals trying to make a new life for themselves in America, BHC also partnered with attorneys David Stoller and Tony Hernandez, who volunteer their time in the center's legal clinic, helping with a wide range of issues from job searches and suspected human trafficking to helping new U.S. residents become citizens. The center depends on a strong volunteer base and proceeds from events such as the popular Viva Brevard Fiesta for funding. As Brevard's population continues to grow in numbers and diversity, so does the support of the Brevard Hispanic Center, a 2019 Central Florida humanitarian organization, Brevard Hispanic Center.